I'm Katie, and this is Katie Plays Stuff, where I play stuff for you. And today, we're getting back to Conway, Disappearance at Dolly of You. All right, guys, sorry for the delay in the videos, but we had Christmas, and then we had New Year's, so I was just busy for the holidays, but we are back, baby. I know that I'm not getting as much feedback on this game as some of my other playthroughs. I know it's not, like, a well-known popular game, so I understand that not everybody is going to love this, but as you know, I am, and my channel is not based around what's popular. It's kind of just whatever I feel like playing because that is the only way that you guys get to watch videos. If I don't enjoy the game I'm playing, you know that I won't be posting for like two months and that's the problem. So as long as I'm enjoying it, you guys get videos. So I hope some of you are enjoying this one. But we are very close to the end, I'm pretty sure. So last time that we played, we went into old lady Doer's house where she actually caught us snooping through her house. So that was scary. Um, but then she allowed us to kind of go into her upstairs, see what's going on up there because she's too old and feeble and she can't get upstairs, uh, where we were seen or I, I don't know, caught. We, we ran into an intruder that was upstairs that was inside of the house. So we chased the intruder down into the basement and we kind of caught them, kinda. They, well, they caught us. They like knocked us out. It, it was pretty intense. Um, but we made it into the basement and found shackles, not shackles, uh, ropes in the basement where it looks like a kid could have been held. Someone could have been kidnapped in Mrs. Doer's basement, which means is she involved somehow? is Shirley involved somehow, because Shirley has been the caretaker for Mrs. Doer, um, who's been cleaning her upstairs for her, and is she involved somehow? So the next part of this game, we are going to creep on Shirley and see what she's been up to. So let's get started. All right, you guys, we are back. So let's get to spying on Shirley. So I, it's been a couple weeks, actually, since I've played so it might take a little bit for me to get back into it. So, what is Shirley doing? Looks like she's in a safe of some sort. Shirley is... Mailbox? Garbage chute? Doing shoot? something safe. Safe. I'm not sure what. What's that noise? What's that noise? What do you hear? What you looking at? Don't give up hope. He's given up. Still looking. He has given up. And she noticed it. Where'd she go? Having a little cigarette break, doing a little spot. What is that with the leg? Oh, she just looked at me. It'd be terrible if you fell from that window. I'm not saying I should take a picture of this, so what else can I look at here? Hmm. What do you got there? What are you looking at? Just checking to see if there's anything else. Looks like nobody's home. Most people are at Sunday service. I didn't peg Levy as the church-going type. Maybe he's Perhaps he's over robbing the donation plate as we speak. She's just sitting, smoking at the moment. Not really doing. She's the door's open. seen or heard something. Who opened that door? Are we gonna witness a murder? She's uh, she's got a weapon. She's scared for her life. That's not Candle good. Stick. That's not going to do anything. Who would be breaking in in the daytime? What in God's name? Is 
there's someone inside with her? My attacker. Something smashed. It's a noise. My attacker is in there as I speak. Don't put your weapon down. Oh god, what if he's inside and I missed it? Shirley, don't do this alone. Trust me. I know how this ends. Turn around and leave. Shirley, be careful. Um, they'll, even if I leave now, I won't get to her in time. I don't know, guys. I'm nervous. Shirley? <gasps> oh, okay, all right. She's searched the whole place. God. It doesn't look like she's seen anyone. Watch your back, Shirley. She's letting her guard down. She put the weapon down. Oh no, this is it. She's leaving. Good. She's safe for now, at least. I hear. I hear. Footsteps. Also, what is this? My attacker fled this way last night. Okay. I wonder if the police even looked. I doubt they believed me. They treated me as if I was the suspect. No one has a clue what's happening. What is he looking at? Even Tony Morgan. Uh, he's seen something. Yeah, what has he seen? Something in the alleyway. God, she's been attacked. Oh my God. Tony. Be careful, Mr. Morgan. It might not be safe. I... Somebody call the police. Anybody, please. There's been another attack. Uh, Mr. Morgan, you take her to the hospital. I'll call the police. Jesus, who did that? Right. Enough time should have passed. Maybe I can get into the crow's nest without anyone seeing me. I'll call the police when I'm good and ready. <laughs> He's like, I'll call the police. Just kidding, I'm going to sneak into her house. <laughs> Let's see what we got for notes in here. Shirley was searching her pub moments before Shirley was attacked. I need to investigate further. Find a way into the crow's nest and make sure the intruder is no longer there. If my attacker is still here, I won't fall prey to them again. I should check the coast is clear. All right. Lady Dower. My attacker was using Lady Dower's home and she had no idea it was happening. That's crazy. Oops. I clicked out of it. Shirley Downs. Shirley was attacked in her place of work. I wonder what she did to provoke it. Then again, what did it? All right, um, let's go check out that phone and call the police. Oh wait, he said he'll call when he's ready. <laughs> so, wait, the phone's back here, isn't it? I mean, oh wait, what's over here again? Nothing, nothing. Let's see. Yeah, isn't there a phone sitting on this table or am I wrong? Is there a phone in here? There wasn't, right? Yeah, I don't think there's gonna be anything new for me to click on. I'm just gonna head on out. We're gonna parkour! Woo! 
Oh, who attacked us? And what did they leave behind? What did they leave behind? Got this broom over here. I just um, see if I can click on the garbage can or not nothing. That's that's something in the street. This belongs to Shirley. Shirley's headband. It must have fallen off during the attack. Okay. <laughs> he, he, he rolls down if I stop. That's funny. Alright. This must be the smash I heard. What kind of a coward attacks someone from behind? Who could it be? The pub. Are you still here? Oh no, guys. This is where Mr. Morgan and Theo joined the search. Search meet point. Daily searches from this point every two hours. Today's search, Dower Docks. Search meeting point. Charlotte May Morgan has been abducted from her home in Dahlia View. Register here to join the search. Pick up a pile of posters to hand out on the route to the search location. Search party briefing will take place in the main bar area. Chalk. It's been days. It's unlikely that at least still be alive. Bard means bad. I'm glad I'm not on Shirley's bad side. Last orders will be at 10 o'clock p.m. If you break, dart, or lose a snooker ball, you will be charged for its replacement or barred. It is not up to my staff to find you a taxi home because of your drunkenness. Think before you drink. Glasses left on the last order's bell will fall off when it rings. You'll be charged for broken pint glasses. The toilet is for men and women. Please be respectful. Also, clean up after yourselves. Remember, bard means bard. Alrighty. Get this room for staff only, which I cannot Locked. get into, of course, because I'm not staff. Stairs, which of course we'll never get up. Landlady private residence. Is anyone up there? Come down if you are. What is this? I sure as hell can't come up. Dirty ass. Raincoat. Seems suspicious. I know you're in here. Oh my god, shut up. I love Conway, I do, but he needs to be quiet. This is why he gets knocked out. Got a kitchen. Ooh. We should keep this. Don't you think? Just in case. Maybe turn off the stove. So we don't burn the place down. Hmm. Well, she must have been cooking when the attacker arrived. Condensed milk. Milk bottle. Downs family recipes. Uh, cocoa? Oh, she's making hot chocolate. Or she's making food. But this is the stuff for hot chocolate, so. At least I, th I think so. Guess I can't get in here either. Nothing to click on. Hello. You can't hide anymore. Is anyone here? No. Well, at least I can look around without keeping an eye over my shoulder. You know, I understand that he doesn't want to call the police, but this is like getting out of hand. Like, he's a feeble old dude in a wheelchair. What is he actually going to do? Does he think he's going to fight this attacker, especially without a weapon? Like, what does he think is really going to happen? And then say he does find out who the intruder is, or the, the 
Is he gonna go to the police then, or is he gonna- I don't understand. I don't get it. Let's check out the toilets. Hello? There's nowhere to hide this time. <laughs> Jesus. Fuck me! Jump scare in it. Are you kidding me? I suppose you think that was funny. You bloody pigeon. Me like that. You have no idea how close I was to doing what? <laughs> Talking to a bloody pigeon. Oh man. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. That was scary! We got good water pressure over here. Why does this look bloody? Jesus, what, what happened here? What happened I here? May. Not with all the police presence, surely. I mean, maybe the kidnapper was just in here. Maybe they cut their hand on that pot outside or something? I don't know. And they washed up, escaped through the window. Nothing here. I'm not sure what I was expecting. Now, what am I going to call you? What the fuck? Useless Malcolm Fluffy. Malcolm. Malcolm. You don't say much, do you? So, Malcolm. Who do you think attacked Shirley and I? Well, no, you're probably right. Is that it? This is very strange. I don't... I don't know, don't ask me, people. Oh, I need a key to get into the bathroom locker. Okay. need a key for that. This is the door to the pub, and then uh, telephone. That apparently we are never going to use. Okay, I need a code for the staff only room. Token. Do I want to use the phone now? Or... No. There's nothing to click on. I just got a token. And then we got another locked door over here. And another one over here. Can't move. Can I read this? There we go. Active police Very investigation. Worth a small peek. Taking place inside Boo Booth. <laughs> Taking place inside Booth's stay out. Inside Booth is. Any trespassers will be arrested. Okay. I think Conway needs to get arrested at this point. Done a lot of illegal things. This is why I don't gamble. This table right here, this is why. Got me a stamp. Malcolm? So this is what the police call looking for Charlotte May. Why did it say Malcolm's name on this? I'm confused. pick up all of this stuff, and it said Malcolm's name there, and I don't know why. Okay. Locked. There's so many locked areas. I don't think I can pick this type of lock. I might need to find a key. 
This is the smash in Shelly and I heard. I should be able to get around it. I guess I could probably use a token, right? But what one do I choose? I have no idea. Hello? Does it need more? Or did I just waste that? <laughs> Ooh, I'm stuck. Oh my god. So the magnetic door can be turned off with the breaker switch in the delivery room. Hey, Shirley. Oh. Hey, Shirley. Have set up the magnetic locks in your office. If you ever want to reset the locks, they are on a fuse board in the delivery room. Nipped away, but we'll be back later to finish up the work in your office, Adam. So the way to get the locks to get into Shirley's office need to be turned off by a fuse board in the delivery room. Okay, so then that means, is this the office then? I can't get in there. And can't get in there. Prices are steep. It's a wonder she has any customers at all. Specials, beer, ciders, hot drinks. Cigarettes. Yeah, just pouring it on the ground. All right. Just letting it go. <laughs> oh, it stops on its own. Okay. Um. This place is so little. Is over here. Well, probably nothing inside it, but worth a look all the same. To Shirley. Let's see. Shirley. Larry came home stinking drunk last night and he walked all the way home with one shoe. I know it's not your responsibility, but you could have called him a taxi. You know he's an idiot when he's had a few. I'm not for having an argument with you, but you know how dangerous it is out there at the moment. Thanks, Sheila. Sheila, take better care of your husband. Don't get mad at Shirley. That Larry he's sounds like a, a charming fellow. Uh, what the hell is this? Couple or handle? A handle of some kind. That must be something to do with the pub. That looks like a staff note. Let's see. Oop, not that. Shirley, leaving in a rush today, but I can't remember where the hell I put the staff keys. Sorry about that. The last thing I did was clean the jukebox and put all the chairs back around the pool table. Then I had a sweep around. Sorry to dump this on you. Also, I will get around to hooking that Braystone's Bitter Barrel later on tonight before the punters show up. Sorry again, Will. How do you just lose the keys, Will? Oh my god, she needs to hire some I have an people. idea where to look, at least. Nothing I can do with that. Got some change. Okay. I guess I gotta go look around the jukebox and the pool table and a 
in a broom. I did come over here, but... I put my, uh... Ah, uh, here's another token. Looks like it's for the jukebox. do you need? Okay. Um, maybe another, need another one? I, I don't know. Hmm. Put the chairs up. in the world. What is... Oh! Oh! What is going on here? Okay, I'm sorry guys, this is like a mini game or something because he won't hold it up. This is actually very, very weird. He like won't hold it... hold it up there. He keeps moving it down. Get your feeble old man arms and hold this damn thing up! There we go! Gotcha. That was annoying. I don't know what that was about. Okay. Are the... What are these keys for? I don't remember. Now I gotta check out the locks. <laughs> uh, not this door. Is it this one? Was it over here? Dartboard. I'm sure I don't need these. I feel like in every level there's always like stuff that I can pick up that I don't actually need. Chalk packet, another dart, damage dart. This will come in handy. Another token. Hmm. What's so? Catherine's trying her best to fit in. Oh, oh, Conway. That's not even me. That's Catherine playing. That's nice. She's trying to fit in. Let me put this token in the jukebox. And hopefully the third one is the charm. Really? How many do you need? Well, we got two more keys. One's gotta open the bathroom, and I don't know what the other one is. All right, let's just check the bathroom first. Hey, Malcolm. Let's see. use for you. What is that? Could be useful. Aqueous dihydroxide what the fuck? Aque aqueous dihydrogen oxide tablets. Mixing this product with any alcohol-based liquids may result in toxic fumes, inhalation of which can lead to blurred vision, loss of memory, and loss of consciousness. Interesting. And more cigarettes. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. What do you think, Malcolm? What do you think? Malcolm. Why didn't you help me to open this locker? <laughs> Sometimes I wonder whose side you're on. 
Okay, it was fun while it lasted. Damn Conway breaking his neck over here. <laughs> All right. All right, what else, what else? Check out this door. Oh, this one has an actual number on it. So, I don't remember getting any numbers. Back it up. So, what is this one? Not that. Oh wait, can I use this hairpin lock on here? Okay. One of these suckers. Okay. And... We did it! Police evidence board. Oh, I thought someone else was what? like watching me. The McKees hit a dog. The McKees have killed dog. Fine. It, it makes sense. Yeah, I knew it was an animal. And Levy was diluting oils, among other things. And Catherine said as much, and I didn't listen. We knew this. All right. I knew that they killed some sort of animal, but that that's fucked up. They killed an animal. I should look a little closer at this. So, he's guilty after all. Just not for the abduction of Charlotte May by the looks of things. I hope they get that warrant soon. It looks like they have a fine coming that way. Poor dog. No wonder they tried to hide it. Circumstantial? Damn the law. They know full well what they found. They're just not allowed to act on it without more evidence. Me? <laughs> well, I can't say I'm surprised. And they're just as clueless to who took her as I am. I wonder what she told them about me. That must be an embarrassment to her. Sarge. All the more reason oh to find God. that little girl and prove myself. Sarge, I know I said a lot of things about my father, but I think having him on the suspect's board is a mistake. He's a good man at heart, and he thinks he was trying to do the right thing. Let me talk to him first and see if I can convince him to drop what he's doing. He'll listen to me, I promise. Just give me a day or two. Jeez. What do I got? And what's this? Evidence I haven't seen. There, No evidence. wonder I'm pulling at straws. Okay, we got... Rag with chemicals. Oh, just as I thought. That's all you have to say? Okay. We got... Rope found at the scene. We've already seen all this. Well, that's what I have too. Glass shard found at the scene. There was something here. Why have they removed it? Ah, interesting. Uh, plant pot shard. Well, this was smashed during the attack. Some of my neighbors claim to have heard it. And the barred list. Shirley thinks that this Larry fellow could have been involved. He sounded too drunk when I heard him. Landlady Down suggested Larry was behaving very odd this evening. I... Larry's shoe is up on the roof, isn't it? What would he be climbing up there for? But it's probably not him. One month for starting a fight, he's not allowed. One month for vandalism by Jim Thompson. Henry, two weeks for spilling the drink on the snooker table. Lifetime accused staff of stealing, Jennifer. Lifetime. Harold Levy. <laughs> hmm. Another token. And... Looks like that's it in here. The place is a gold mine for my evidence board. Go 
goodness, my dog is needy tonight. He's now sitting here with me in the chair. So if you hear any grunting or snoring, that's what he's doing. All right. Not that. Where are my keys at? What? My keys don't work? Oh, okay. It's another one of these. say police report it's a little small I need my glasses I can't even zoom I can zoom in here but I can't zoom on this so that's annoying oh, who would be calling on a Sunday morning I'm trying to read who right now answering? should I should I read this uh, assault on Tony Morgan with a weapon I guess I'll be able to read it later because it's gonna be on yeah, my evidence basically board basically what the newspaper said yeah. No. Nothing there. Are these all kidnappings from the past? Kidnappings... Looks like this note's been flagged by an officer. She gets okay. more and more interesting every time. I wonder if any of them are related to Charlotte May. Alright, I guess... That's it. In here. Alright, who's calling? And why would I answer it if I'm intruding, you know? Hello, the crow's nest. Oh, thank God. I was worried Shirley might answer. My name's William Crow. Uh, yes, Mr. Crow. What is it I can do for you? I'm sorry, officer. I, I wanted to speak to one of you yesterday, but I lost my nerve. I oh, oh, sorry. I'm the pub owner of the Crow's Nest. Really? I thought that Shirley was the owner. <laughs> no, no, no. She has a habit of telling people that, but she just manages the place. Is that so? Can I talk to you about something, officer? Uh, well, I... Uh, listen, I don't want Shirley to get into trouble, but I I've got to get it off my chest. Go ahead. Well, I saw her do something yesterday whilst I was locking up. Go on. Oh, God. She took something from your evidence room. I don't know what, and I don't care to find out, but I can tell you where she put it. I think that that would be a good idea, son. You promise me she won't get into any trouble? I'll have a word with her and leave it at that. As long as you tell me where it is. I, I, I think we're all good, Mr. Crow. Thank you, officer. You're a good man. Yeah, so, where do I look? The pillar that Officer Foster put his fist through the other night. You know the one? Uh, uh, yes. And, again, we're sorry about the mess. Hey, I, I'm a sore loser at darts myself. I just hope his hand's okay. Anyway, we, we put up a poster to cover the hole, so that's where she hid it. Mr. Crow, could you do me a favor and stay on the line whilst I check? Uh, sure thing. Okay. So there's a poster covering a hole in a pillar. Also, I know that this is not something I need to be thinking about or talking about right now, but that voice actor for William Crow, he sounds kind of hot. And I'm going to be looking him up after this, so... If anybody wanted to know what Katie's going to be doing later... <laughs> Oop, not that. Not this. Wait, can I take this down? There we are. Glass shard. So Mr. Crow was right. Shirley stole this from the police evidence room. Why would she How steal she it? Think? This does not look like the behavior of an innocent woman. I'd better tell him that I found it. Why? Can I click that? No. Why would she hide that? I still don't think she's involved. I don't think any of the people are involved, to be honest. Right, 
not this. There we go. Mr. Crow? You found it? Yes. Thank you very much for coming to us with this. You're welcome. And between you and me, I think Shirley's up to something. I don't want the pub's good name dragging through the mud if I'm right. Well, you did the right thing. Good. Oh, and she obviously found a way into your case rooms. Don't ask me how. If you need a place to store any evidence, then you can use my locker in the room just to your right. Not sure how safe it is for you, but it's something. That's very kind of you. I think I will take that code. Uh, sure thing. It's 8068. You've been a great help to us, Mr. Crow. Thank you again. My pleasure, officer. And please, go easy on her. Good day, Mr. Crow. Good day. Well, I think Mr. Crow's the bad guy, guys. <laughs> Impersonating an officer. I'm going to burn in hell for that one. Yeah, I don't... For some reason, I'm getting bad vibes. He was too helpful, too nice. Um, he, like, really wanted to pin it on Shirley. He knows, like, if it actually is the bad guy and he just, like, attacked Shirley in the alleyway, he knows for a fact that Shirley wasn't there. And he knows that Conway is inside because he probably saw him go in. And that's why he called, you know? I think it could be that guy. So... That's gonna be my guess right there. Alrighty. Uh, Shirley Downs. The office door is locked. The office door lock has been upgraded. She doesn't want people entering at all. What is she hiding? Mr. Crow is right. Shirley hid the police evidence. Is she involved? No, I saw her get attacked. It doesn't make sense. I think maybe she didn't put that in there at all. Maybe he did. Oops, I wasn't finished. Harold Levy. Catherine was right. Levy did everything illegal but kidnap Charlotte May. Still, he's an awful man who deserves his comeuppance. Uh, Annabelle. Annabelle convinced Theo to kill a dog he'd run over and injured. She obviously didn't want her want to get her own hands dirty, so she gave Theo a choice. A sharp knife or a plunt mallet. That's fucked up. Theo. Theo hit a dog with a car. He must have been too afraid to go to the police. I can only assume the car was borrowed from Levy's garage. Why do they still have things next to them? Okay. I don't know. Um, I forgot what the code was. <laughs> it was like 8068 or something. 806. I was right! You go, memory! Alright, so this is that room I couldn't get into. Beer coupler. Maybe this thing? Okay. Right. I've done that. Oh. Turn off gas lever on pressure valve. Connect beer pipe from blue mains valve. Uh, place gas coupler handle. Turn the coupler handle anti-clockwise until it clicks. Turn gas back on. So I need to hook up this blue main valve thingy thing. Oop, not that. Uh... Wait, what about... Cider? No. I don't know. Let me, um... See what else is in here. There we go. A spare pipe of some kind. Got a token! Not that. Lock all hazardous cleaning products in the cabinet in the gents' toilet after use. Let's hook up this hose thing. Hose. To you. Right? Really? <sighs> there 
There we go. There we go. Text. What next? Now, we gotta turn this anti clockwise. There that we sounded go. like a good strong click to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then. Right? What am I missing? Turn the gas back on. Test the beer flow at the tap, serving the customers. So what one is this one called? Greystone something something bitter. So I gotta go all the way back out there and test this thing? <laughs> and see if it works? We're going in. This one. Really? It doesn't work. I... I thought I did it. Turned and on. Oh, okay. I, I did it! I just had to flip it again. I don't know why I needed to do this, though. It's not a time to be drinking. There we go. Why did we do that? For what reason? Hmm. You can't even, like, pick up a cup, or... There's no reason to pick up a cup. Okay, this is dumb. I don't know. What's, what's my next objective? What am I doing? There's a full barrel of beer in the delivery doorway blocking my path. Okay. Now that I pour out the beer, right? Let's just do it one more time. It's all gone now. Okay. So... Now I can push it out of the way? Okay. One of these guys. Shit! Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. This looks like the stock delivery I've just destroyed. I hope it wasn't too expensive. Riverport stock delivery. Very interesting. I've hooked up the switch by your office door to ring the last order's bell. Okay. Hmm. Now, let's see if those office doors have opened. Is there anything else in here? What was this? Oh, another door. Cool. Is there anything else in here, though? No. Alright, so now what door is it? The one that has her name on it? That's in here? Maybe? Ah, oh, wait! You guys see that? Just kidding, I didn't see- I thought I saw a coin on the floor. No, it must have just been glass glistening. Right there! It looks like there's like a, a coin on the floor. <laughs> Alright, well let's put this token in. That we got. We get two more. That one, and that one. Hello? Hello? Put it in! That's what she said, but put it in! I don't understand. Why won't it go in? 
Okay, I needed to back out. How many coins do you need? I gave up on this machine. Stupid. Uh, was it this way? Yeah, this door's open now. Office. This where she was having her smoke break. Oh, look, I'm on... Oh yeah, I was off-roading. I already know Shelly's a thief. I don't feel bad about this at all. Got a stamp! You gonna open it up, or...? No, you won't even look in there. Shirley is after something for Annabelle's birthday. Book that Annabelle is waiting for is a birthday gift trilogy. Well, I don't have to guess what she wanted from him. She has everyone convinced that she owns the place. She's a compulsive liar. Maybe she does own the place, and that guy was lying. Shelley isn't very organized. Annabelle, 30 this year. Hmm. Okay. Wait, what was here that I... And why does it want my inventory out? I don't know. How to spot a genuine fake? Hmm. Nothing. I thought I saw you come in here, Mr. Morgan. What on earth are you doing, Mr. Conway? I'm looking for Charlotte May. I told you I'd stop at nothing to find her. Indeed you did. And you breaking into Shirley's pub is your way of doing that? Do you really want to know? I'm not sure I do. Though I could ask you the same thing. What are you doing here, Mr. Morgan? Well, when I saw you come over here, I... I, I couldn't do it any longer. Do what? Let other people act for me. Sit on my bottom whilst my daughter... It's a father's responsibility to protect his child, and I... I should have... Mr. Morgan, not everybody is cut out for this. It's fully understandable if you're not. Well... Uh, you see what I mean? You can't bring yourself to say it. I'm a coward, and it's shameful. I don't think you're a coward. Then tell me what I can do. Let me prove it to you. Let me help in some way with... What is it you're doing, exactly? You can help by making your way back home and letting... Robert, please. Very well. The flat upstairs. Obviously, I can't search it myself, so perhaps you can shed some light up there. Thank you. And please, you only have to say if I'm putting you out. We will need to hurry, Mr. Morgan. Understood. Well, this is weird. Guys! I don't know. This is so weird. I'm still sticking with my idea that the owner of the pub is the bad guy, just because I feel like that would be... I don't know. That would be it, I think, because I don't think any of these other people are. But then, this guy comes into the picture, and he's like, I saw you go in there, but, like, wasn't he taking Shirley to the hospital? Like, when did he see us come in here? 
So that's a little suspicious too. Like, what if he comes down and like hits us over the head in a second? I don't know. But why would he kidnap his own daughter? I don't know. But anyway. Oh, by the way, how is Shirley Downs? Has she been treated? Yes, the doctor said she was fine. She'll be released later today. Did she say who attacked her? No, she didn't say. Damn. Well, uh, thank you for that, anyway. That's fine, Mr. Conway. So what am I looking for up here? Uh, anything that looks interesting or out of the ordinary, I suppose. Uh, I'm not sure if this counts, but th there's a locked door up here. Yeah, they're everywhere. What's so strange about that? Well, it's locked, but there's no keyhole. Hmm, that is strange. A anything else? There's a panel on the side, if that helps. It looks like it might open somehow. Perhaps. Uh, leave it with me. I'll find a way in. Okay. This is garbage. Oh, what is this? This soldering I might come in handy. Oh. Okay. Upstairs safe, pub door, something. Oh, uh, this thing? Solder this? No. What is this? Frayed wires. Do I have anything? Glass. Something opened in this room. Something in this room opened. So what's in here? People really are moving on. Throw it out. This thing? like a clock ticking? Is it over here? On oh, the last order's bell. Hmm. Hmm. What could have opened? Hmm. Now what's this then? Screwdriver. She's got a camera too. And take the film out of it? No. I don't know what could have opened in here. Oh wait, I got it. These keys. Those don't work. This is where I've been searching. The upstairs is in the top right. Junction magnetic door. Switches. I've already found those. He said something opened in here, though, and I don't know what it could have been. on me. That's it though, right? 
Yeah, the wall. Right here. That took me forever. Hmm. This is from Lady Doe's home. She ah. was right to hide her belongings under the floorboards. Shirley has light fingers. She did steal it. And how do I get in here? I'm going to need something to pick this open. To pick it Mr. open? Mr. Morgan? You can call me Tony, you know. Oh, of course, I'm sorry. There's a music box down here. It's identical to her sister's. Is there anything up there that I might be able to use as a pick? Uh, okay. What would I need to look for? Uh, uh, something small enough to fit into a lock. Oh my god, like I've been doing it the whole time. Driver? Smaller than that. Like a needle I can bend or a piece of wire. Where would you like me to begin? Uh, bear with me one second. I should use the blueprint on Shirley's desk to guide Mr. Morgan. Okay. Here's the whole of the upstairs mapped out. Let's see. I'm ready to guide you. Are you ready to look? Okay, I'm ready. Am I? Oh, bed, wardrobe, shelves. Wardrobe. Is the wardrobe unlocked? Looking now. There's a coat hanger. Perfect. Uh, can you throw it down to me? Will do. Can you come to the stairs? If this becomes a thing where I have to choose an object and then it doesn't work and then I gotta come back over here and choose another object, oh my god. I'm ready. Okay. Got Catch. it. I... God. At least I caught it that time. <laughs> Let's hope this works. There it is. Mm, open up. So it's say? A sister's love is forever, a shoulder to lean on when or wherever. A love built to last, strong and steadfast, a sister's love is forever. Okay. We got another key. This game is just that getting keys. Oh, good. Anything useful? I'll let you know. Anything on your end? No, not yet. Probably not even looking. He's probably just sitting up there like a weirdo. Oh, I, I saw you last night with the police. What? What was all that about? None of your business. You mean the police haven't told you? Told me what? For God's sake. It's probably nothing, but I thought that Charlotte May may have been in Lady Doa's home. What? You saw my Charlotte? No. Oh, no, and I may very well have been mistaken. I don't understand. You. Why didn't the police tell me? They mustn't have found enough evidence. Oh, they didn't believe me. Do you think she was... There. Perhaps. But I have no proof. I'm sorry. That's why I'm continuing my search. Is everything all right? Let's carry on, Mr. Conway. All right. Breaking this dude's heart up there. What do we got? It looks like there's a safe hidden in that room up there. Oh? Yes. We need to try and open the panel somehow. Uh, there's nothing obvious up here. Perhaps there's something you have to press down there. Okay, uh, leave it with me. Alright. 20th of June, Annabelle's 30th birthday is this month. I can't believe it's been 30 years. That's it. I'm officially old. Guys, when I'm, like, playing this game and she goes, Annabelle's 30th birthday is this month, like, I'm like, oh my god, she's so fucking old. Like, I'm literally, like, thinking that in my head. Like, that sounds old. But I'm 28. <laughs> and, like, 2022, this year, I turned 29. 
I am old as shit. Thank God I look young, but still. I know I'm not. And it's really unfortunate. I literally had two drinks. Two drinks on New Year's Eve. And I had a full-on migraine the next day. And felt like I was going to die. I had to stay in bed until 4 p.m. So, don't get old, people. Uh, that's it. I'm officially old. I never thought I'd end up doing this in my mid-30s, but here I am, running a pub. I don't own selling beer to punters I don't like. To future me, if you read this back and you're still stuck in Dahlia Bloody View in 30 years, then do us both a favor. My little sister is more figured out than I do. Why can't I be more like her? 23rd of June. Reminders. Get posters made. Contents. The safe upstairs is off limits to all staff, even if I'm not there. Under no circumstances is anyone to open it. Get Adam, the electrician, to change locks on the office when doing wiring. Alright, so. Let's solder this little thingy together. Uh, right? Didn't I pick up some soldering stuff? Yeah. That's perfect. Should work. Let Mr. Morgan? Yes? Try that door again. I think I might have cracked it. It's open. How did you do that? I have my ways. Oh my god, back uh, it can up! Can you take a look inside? I'm almost certain there's a safe in there. D doing it now. Y you were right, there is a safe. Pub takings, I'd imagine. Probably, yes. Uh, let me know if you find a key for it. I will do. Mr. Conway? Yes? This all feels a little... Uh, well, now that I'm here, I feel a little uncomfortable doing this. Well... Do you want to find your daughter? I'll keep looking. How does it open? Uh, I, I did look, but give me a second. Uh, it takes a key of some kind and there's a dial for a combination. Do you have anything to use as a pick? Okay, the hanger to you. I, I can get another one, though. You could come down and Perfect. get it. Okay, I'm going to throw you something. All right. I'm at the stairs waiting. Or just walk down the stairs and get it. Anyway. Ah, I've gained entry into Shirley's office. I need to find some evidence. Shirley's safe code has been changed to Annabelle's birth year, which is... Annabelle's birth year? Or birthday? Her birthday is the 20th of June, but what's the, the year? I don't fucking know. What does it say? Annabelle? Shirley is regretting getting older and having little to show for her life. Her sister's turning 30 is only reminding her. Yeah, she's turning 30, but like what year is it right now? I don't, I don't remember. Tension wrench. <laughs> oh, <blah. laughs> Apologies. I don't know my own strength. Uh, not to worry. I can see it. Thank you. Right. I'll try and find a code. Let's try... What year is it? Oh, man. I said it was changed to her birth year? Is it 1953 right now? One, nine, two, three. Not that. Okay. Uh, well, what, about her, in. what about her actual birthday? Like zero. Six. Six. Two. Zero. That didn't... 
What the fuck was her birthday? Oh my god. Mr. Morgan needs a safe code. What would Shirley use? Annabelle's birth year. Maybe what? something in this office. What is the fucking year? How? What's the... I can't even talk. <laughs> what's the date? Oh, there's a calendar. There's a calendar in here. Right? Somewhere. There's a calendar. Here. Oh, it's 19... 1954. Oh, 54. I thought it was 1953. Okay, so I was almost right, guys. I said 1923. It's 1924. Okay. It's, it's this one, one uh, nine, nine, two, two four. four. We're in. We're in. Well, uh, at least the combination worked. I still have no idea what to do with this thing you threw to me. Oh, God. We're going to pick that lock, Mr. Morgan. Okay, uh, and how on earth does one start that? You see the hairpin? I do. Well, put that to one side. The other thing you have is called a tension wrench. Okay. Insert it into the lock near the bottom. Uh, I've done that. Now this next part requires some patience. Oh dear. Put the coat hanger above the wrench and put it to the back of the lock. We're going to navigate around the lock by feel. I'm not sure this is something I can do, Mr. Conway. Yes, you can. Just try to be slow. Okay. Uh, so, wait, I'm actually doing it? Blaster! Oh my god. I'm sorry it slipped out. That's what she said. Not to worry. <laughs> Just start again. Mr. Conway, I really don't think I can do this. Trust me. Yes, you can. Fine, I'll try again. The first one down. You need to move the pig to the back of the lock. There are probably around three or four things to pick before you're done. Keep going. Thank you. Second pin down. Keep going. You're doing well. That's three down. You're almost there. Thank you for your patience, Robert. I don't believe it. You did it. You it's did open. it. Well done. Right. Uh, uh, let's take a look inside. Oh, dear God. I think this might be what you were looking for. This is hair. Hair? Maybe dried blood, too. Does this... Mean. I don't understand. What's the matter? It's the weapon with blood on it. Did you know this was here? It's a telescope. I can assure you I did not. Then what does this mean, Mr. Conway? Stop touching it. It could mean anything. It's best not to jump to conclusions, at least until I've had a chance to examine it further. You're just going to take this fucking weapon with you? Let me take a look. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Perfect fit. Oh, no. Where is my daughter, Mr. Conway? You promised you'd find her. Mr. Morgan, let's find out together. This isn't good. Also, I don't know how much longer we have in this game, like, when I should stop this video, or, like, I don't know. After searching Shirley's pub, it's clear to me that she's a person of questionable morality. 
The glass shard that the police found matched the small telescope perfectly. I'm positive it was the weapon used to hit Tony Morgan, but I have found no trace of Charlotte May. This is my last chance. I need to know a few more things before I accuse Shirley of anything. All right, guys, we are pros at this now. Can I place Shirley Downs at the telescope on the night Charlotte May was taken? Oh, she was looking through a telescope. Shirley used Lady Doa's telescope to spy on the Morgans. Is there any evidence that places her in Lady Doa's home on the night that Charlotte May was taken? Yeah, so can I find out that she was just watching? She wasn't actually involved in the crime. The only proof of an intruder at Shirley Downs' pub was a glass they may have smashed during the attack. Is it possible that there was no intruder? Is it possible the glass could have smashed in some other way? Is there another way the glass could have been smashed? Does any of the evidence here match the police report excerpts? I've taken some excerpts from the police report I found. Can I use them to connect Shirley to the kidnapping? All right, so I guess we'll start with the, probably the easiest one, which is, can she be in Lady Doer's house? Ugh, this is all a bunch of reading. So this has to do with the pub, because that's a map of the pub. This is the chemical. That's a child abduction report. What is this one? Last orders will be at 10 p.m. If you break a dart or lose a sin roll, you'll be charged for its replacement. It's not up to staff. Glasses left on the last order bell fall off when it will fall off when it rings. Okay. This one goes here. Maybe this is the easiest one. And what's this one? Stock delivery. Green binding rope, black binding rope, cloth tooth hammer, aqueous dihydroxazine tablets or something. And which is this stuff. Okay. Oh wait, um, this has to do with the bar. Let me just look at this quick. The bar, junction table, snooker table light, wall socket. There's only one more to go for this evidence. Is there another way it could have been smashed? So it could be, oops, it could be this one. Barred list. Month for starting a fight. I don't think this is necessary. Injury trauma would imply assaults occurred with a heavy blown object. Deposits found. Okay, this is something to do with the body. Okay, I don't think any of these have to do with the bar. Larry came home stinking drunk last night. You could have called him a taxi. I'm not for having an argument with you. You know how dangerous it is out there. I don't think this is important either. Larry stumbling around outside the gate with one shoe, saw her in the kitchen, lost sight of both. He cuddles her. Cat knocked the bin over, both upstairs in the front bedroom. And what's this? Traces of motor oil mixed with blood sample. Angle of wood. Angle of wood implies that the attacker was shorter. Okay, it's gotta be in this map then. It's gotta be something in this map. Oh, I gotta choose one of these over here. Glasses left in the last order's bell will fall off when it rings. Last order's bell. Where is that on here? Last order's button, junction E. Junction E. Good. Ah! Now to sort out everything else. Guys, I did one without messing up for the first time. I'm so proud. Yeah, let's see if we can do it again. I don't think we can. All right. Um, telescope or 
Does any of the evidence here match the po report excerpts? I've taken some excerpts from the police report I found. I don't know. Can I use them to connect Shirley to the kidnapping? Connect Shirley to the kidnapping? Traces of heavy liquid sedative found at the scene. That could be one, I guess. And then she bought this, the tablets. Loss of consciousness. Let's do that one. We'll do... This one... I'm a little unsure about that one because there's so much stuff on that page. And she did sign off on it. So it could be like her initial could be it, you know? Courier is too dark. Traces of motor oil mixed. All neighbors were pre what is that? All neighbors were present in Dahlia View on the night of the attack. All neighbors were present. Let's do this one. Liquid sedative. This is the wrong one. Where is it? This one. Liquid sedative. And then... Deposits found on the victim's clothing implied weapon. Likely made of metal. Injury trauma. Heavy blunt object. Attacker. Medium sized boots. Tuesday, 22nd of June. That could be interesting. 22nd of June, and then maybe this one connects to... Uh, 22nd of June isn't on here. I feel like... Okay, this is definitely not anything. This... This Larry, this... This has to do with Larry, too! So maybe these are important. And then... Shirley used Lady Doa's telescope Sorry, to spy I keep on the Morgans. This. Is there any evidence that places her in Lady Doa's home on the night that Charlotte May was taken? Stumbling around the outside gate with one shoe. Lost sight of both. So she. Oh, okay, wait. Maybe she's watching him from the telescope, and this is. These are her notes. So maybe that place is her watching through the telescope. That's the only thing that can make sense, is that she's watching. And then we'll do him in this one, because it has to do with him as well. Where did that go? Oh, okay. Uh... This one. Good. I thought as much. Okay, I that continue. that still doesn't even make sense to me, but but it, it just means that she was watching him. So I'm missing something here. But I feel like I got all the right things. I just must have the wrong. I don't know. Attacker may have worn medium work boots. Fiber from multicolored black and green rope, possibly for bindings. That was... So, okay. This is like evidence. Does any of the evidence here match the police reports? So, in the police reports, we had the, um, the chloroform. And then there was rope. So I'll do the rope. Ah. There must be some oh. small detail here. <laughs> Guys, I don't know. What did I choose? Uh, liquid sedative. Unrecognized blue jumper thread found on victim's person, perhaps. So it probably goes to each one of the things. So there was rope, there was the chloroform cloth thing, there's green binding rope, black binding rope, 
claw tooth hammer. Guys, I am not fucking kidding. I just found this in here. <laughs> this little sentence. I didn't even notice it was there. Um, but that just took me so fucking long. Like, I've been recording for close to two hours. Anyway, I couldn't get any of that two-tone rope you normally use. That's gotta be it. That must be so But Okay, but that's gotta here. be it. So then what am I... What's down here? Traces of liquid. Back to the... What I was at. There we go. Oh my god. That's it. By the police's account, Shirley had access to the same type of rope and chloroform of a sort. Match that with the telescope as an attack weapon, and I think I have all the means I need. I can even place her at the window, watching over Charlotte May just minutes before she was taken. I spent so much time looking at the McKees and Harold Levy. It's Shirley. It has to be. Dear God, I hope I'm not too late. Oh, my eyes are really watering. Time to gather my neighbors and share my suspicions. Put an end to this once and for all. Guys, I don't know how much longer is in this game. I've been recording for like two hours. I know I'm going to cut it down a lot because there was a lot of me just going to bumping into shit and <laughs> and fiddling around with things so i'm definitely gonna try to cut it down but i don't know if i should stop it or if like this is the end of the game and this is it so i'm going to keep going for a little bit just to see what the next part is and if it's like almost over or not if not we're gonna stop it for here all right guys so i just played a little bit longer and it still seems to have i don't know maybe like 10 20 more minutes of the game and i just played for about 15 minutes I'm just gonna put it into another video so um I'm going to cut where I said I was gonna cut and then in the next video you're going to see me in this outfit again and then you're gonna see me in another outfit because I'm gonna splice them together but anyway thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one bye